And we're with Brad Moore, the NERVDA president, and we're at the Boston RV and Camping Expo. And uh, Brad, tell us a little bit about what you thought about the attendance yesterday and the, the quality of the people, but numbers, because uh, here it is Saturday morning and people are lined up out the door to get in. So tell us what you think so far about the show. Well, it's the second day of the show. It's Saturday, and uh, we're just about two hours into it, and the lines have been out the door. Uh, we've got four ticket windows open, and they're they're moving the people in as fast as they can. And inside, it's uh, you know, it's 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 like the old days. It's almost like a little frenzy. Right. And, so, the, uh, but there's still plenty of room. Oh, it's still a, plenty of room. This, for... a, this is a big hall. Yeah, there's no doubt about it. And there's hundreds of RVs here, and there's plenty of room for everybody. And uh, the interest level. I mean, the people that I talk to. Uh, they're here not only to shop and see the new models, they're here to make some deals. And so these are people that have done the research and they're here, now they want to they want to see and feel and touch. Right. And then play, let's make a deal with you guys. Let's make a deal. And uh, as, as much as we dealers, uh, you know, we're friendly competitors, we're here to sell the vehicles as well. So between you and me, I mean, you are in a let's make a deal mode. Oh, sure. You know, I, I kid around and say, people, look at my ears. I got big ears. You know, let's uh, talk to me. You know, if we can make something happen, uh, it'd be good for all of us. Okay, so why don't you just take a second and invite everybody in New England down to the show and tell us where it's at, and uh, we'll get this on the Internet and well, say, come it, on down. As, as a lot of people know, that uh, this is the Bayside Expo down in Dorchester, Mass., just outside of Boston, exit 15, and uh, we're here through Martin Luther Monday, and uh, today's a beautiful day, and, and I'm looking out the window here, and there's this... There's a hundred people outside waiting to get inside. Uh, and, to buy and we'll look at what you're look. Oh, and there they are. Yeah, there, there they are. are. Parking lot is full. Yeah, yeah. Always nice though, with all this negative doom and gloom, to see people in a buying mood, right? Well, you know, RV people are very resilient. It's a very economical way to, to, to spend your vacation dollars. And uh, for those with, with the little kids, you're building memories for a lifetime in, in good, nice environments. There's campgrounds here. That you can talk to the people that own and run them. they got friends working their booths that can tell you about the campgrounds. Uh, there's so much to do here. Right. And, Brad, as we turn the table to turn the camera over to the crowd, we can see that uh, there are some families here with real young kids that uh, could be campers for life. Oh, absolutely. That's probably out of any year. We've got so many young families here, which for, from a dealer standpoint, that's the start of, of how it starts. And we make it easy from a, a ticket price or a free for the kids coming in um, to come in, bring the kids in. There's refreshments here. Uh, it's very, very make it easy for you. Okay. I think we even saw an eight-week-old baby <laughs> somewhere here. Uh, oh, right over there, because if, if you have a, an infant, the infant is free, right? The infant is free. Okay. Great. From Boston, let's go to the Internet world.